Alright guys, this video is going to explain the loft feature on CAD quiz number 3, the exhaust manifold. At this point, you should already have created the manifold flange. That's a pretty simple extrude exercise. And you should already have done the offset planes from the center of the leftmost large circle. 14 inches for this sketch, 22 inches for this sketch. The right sketch is going to have these two circles. The left sketch is going to have this series of four circles and this outline with all the dimensions here provided, including the offset from what I used as the origin point, but it's just simply the center line of the circles and the right side or the far side of the flange. With that information, you get these two sketches and you can do a loft pretty simply. Select the profile between the two circles and this profile. Don't worry about guide type. Just make sure it's on new body and you get this nice solid profile and some people get a little concerned that it's a solid profile but that's what Loft wants to do. So it's a really easy fix to hollow this thing out. First we're going to use the shell command and click that back face. And, oh wait, I clicked hole, sorry. Kind of looks similar. So this is the shell command. I'm going to click that back face. And the difference in the two circles is point, I'll just do it mathematically. Um, 3.156 minus 3 is 0.156. But with the circles, I can divide that by 2 for the thickness. And that's 0.078. It's actually also given to you. Um, further up in the drawings, but 0.078 is what you're looking for. Once you click enter, it essentially hollows that out into like a vessel. Then what we're going to do is turn on the sketch with our circles, and we're just going to simply extrude cut these. One, two, three, four. Go to cut. Now don't go all the way through or you'll cut through the flange here. You can just do like a minus 0.1. Anything over that 0 0.078 will cut it minus 0.1 and as you can see we can see all the way through so that is now ready to um, go ahead and do the tubes now for the tubes you're going to want to access these center points so you probably want to turn on um, your sketches there turn on the sketches that have these center points because you're going to start sketching your path center lines from uh, from these center points of the circles to the corresponding center points of the circles on the collector. Then once you have your solid path with the right uh, radius on all the direction changes, then you just simply do the sweep tool and you have your finished product of the uh, exhaust manifold.